Fabulous. So today we have the following question for Ask Allison. I feel like little stuff is falling through the cracks lately. One or two emails a week go unanswered. I forget to follow up with someone. It's been a really busy month. Is this the start of burnout or am I just busy recovering? Um, so I can't answer that is this burnout question for you. That's something you have to answer for yourself. We're going to come at it from a couple different places because whether or not it's burnout, systems are your friend here. Um, I suspect you probably have been operating with systems that have worked up until now. And what we often see in our practices is that the systems that worked when things were a little bit slower, um, we had a little bit more time on our hands, don't always translate when we've got a full busy practice. Don't worry, because I'm not saying you have to switch practice management systems if that's where you're at, unless you happen to go with a practice management system that is just not, um, not very robust. I mean, if it's just really not meeting your needs, then by all means switch. But, and if you're in that situation, Therapy Notes makes it like super, super easy to switch over. So if you're in that position, Therapy Notes has your back, and it's robust enough for any practice size from like one client to hundreds and hundreds, um, which wouldn't be your clients. That would be group practice, hopefully. Um, okay. So what I mean when I talk about systems is um, like the way in which and the time at which you return phone calls and you return emails. When things are not working in, in my systems, like my favorite system to start with is to look at my calendar and see what needs to be tweaked there. So... Um, do you have time allotted, like put in your schedule where you're returning emails and phone calls? Um, is it, if so, is it frequent enough that you're getting back to people in a timely manner? And I don't mean like if you happen to get to work 10 minutes early, that's when you do it. It means you get to work 10 minutes early or you get to work 30 minutes early or whatever it looks like to do this, that that is in your schedule as like your work time shifts. Or maybe it's, I don't want to put it during your lunch break because I want you to have time to like, sit and be, but maybe you schedule a longer lunch break in the middle of the day, um, like maybe an hour and a half instead of an hour, and half hour of that is you taking care of these phone calls and that kind of stuff. Um, so that's my favorite. Um, and and I, I put it in your schedule, or I'm encouraging you to put it in your schedule, because what we do with phone calls and emails is we make the assumption that it's going to be um, like just a quick thing and we'll get to it. And sometimes we have a like, oh, I hate listening to voicemail or I don't want to call. I hate calling people back. Whatever your ugh is, um, if it's in your schedule, you're more likely to get it done. And it's not going to be one of those things where you just like mark the email and read and decide to come back to it later and then forget. Um, another thing that you could consider is hiring somebody to manage your phone and your email. Um, that's a whole other conversation that we're not going to get into here, but I want to put that bug in your ear. Um, we have a whole course in the Abundance Party called Full Practice New Problems because there are like, there are new problems. There are new problems when you're full. We all kind of look at it as Shangri-La. Once we get full, everything's going to be easy, but there are new and different things to manage and it's all manageable and it's all awesome, but sometimes we have to make some shifts and some changes. Um, if it is burnout, we also have a course in there called Private Practice Life Burnout, which is honestly my favorite course, I think. So if if you need help with those things, we got you over in the Abundance Party. You can check that out at AbundanceParty.com. If you have questions for Ask Allison, y'all, please shoot me an email over at ask at AbundancePracticeBuilding.com, and I'd love to answer them. All right, I'll talk to you later.